Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Sims 4 build video and welcome back to another Sims 4 get famous video. So again, thank you so much to SimGuru Kate and the Sims 4 team and EA for giving me the opportunity to get my hands on this pack early and allowing me to make content with it. So thank you guys so much. I know that by the time this video goes up, it might not be like early access anymore because the pack might already be available to the public by now, but still, Thank you so much for letting me kind of play with the pack early and film these videos. But yeah, for those of you who have not met me, my name is Ashley and I make Sims 4 videos on my channel. So if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to check out more of the videos I have after this one. I have a lot of Sims 4 Get Famous content out right now, so definitely go check that out and stay tuned for even more. So if you guys, you know, haven't really decided yet whether or not you want to buy the pack, definitely check out all the content that I have on it and also check out all the other content from other EA Game Changers about the pack and that can really help you decide whether or not you want to buy it for yourself. So I hope that these videos really do help you guys to decide if you want to spend the money and buy it. Because I know from personal experience as well that not every single pack appeals to certain players so you definitely don't need to buy every single pack if you don't want to so definitely do your research and decide for yourself whether or not you want that pack in your game or not so I personally think that this pack is so so nice and so so beautiful definitely by far the most beautiful pack we have had ever so I know a lot of people did you know, complain about the world and the lot size, and I've talked about that already, so no need to really talk about it anymore, but trust me, you guys, when you do get your hands on this pack and kind of see how beautiful the world is, you will love it. So on to the video today. So today's build uses only the base game and the new Get Famous expansion pack, as per usual, of course. Duh, you're on my channel. It's going to be a limited pack build. So today I am building a starter home. So I know that when people get their hands on the build, they they want to kind of start from the bottom because especially with this pack the whole storyline behind it is you can get famous so you'll start from the bottom and you'll be you know poor and a nobody essentially and you're trying to get famous whether it's by being an actor or being in commercials or being a famous anything pretty much you can be a famous chef you can be a famous painter you can literally be a famous anything. I think you can even be a YouTuber, which is crazy. So this whole pack is about getting famous and starting from the bottom. So I think that a lot of people would need kind of starter homes to get started with their career and get started on their journey to becoming a celebrity. So no hate to EA or anything, but the starter homes that usually come with the new worlds kind of need a little bit of work, not gonna lie. Um, if you guys are familiar with my channel, I have a series called Love It or List It, where I renovate all of the default Sims apartments in San Maishuno, and I am soon going to be taking that series to other worlds. So I think I'm gonna start with this world, Del Sol Valley, and then I'm gonna kind of take it to Willow Creek, I'm gonna take it to Brindleton Bay and everywhere. So if you guys like renovation videos and that kind of thing, definitely go check out my series, Love It or List It. So yeah, basically my point is the starter homes that usually come with the worlds just kind of need a little bit of work. So I thought I would help you guys out a little bit and make a beautiful Get Famous Del Sol Valley starter home that you guys can plop right into your game and get started with your gameplay. So that was kind of the idea behind today's video is to have a house all ready for you guys so you can play it in your game when you do decide to buy the pack. So let me know if you guys also want to see me build like a Hollywood Hills mansion type of a build for when you have finally become a celebrity and you can afford to buy that uh, let me know I can definitely try and work on that for you guys but yeah if you haven't seen my videos already I actually did build some houses up in the Hollywood Hills area of Del Sol Valley and it was kind of like a challenge video I used every single furniture piece from the get famous expansion pack in one build so if that kind of interests you a lot or a little bit definitely go check out that video it's already posted on my channel it was a huge huge challenge 
but yeah, I've used every single item from this pack in one build. So I actually separated it out into two videos. So I used all of the bougie gaudy items in one mansion build and I used all of the mid-century modern items in another build. So if you guys wanted to see all of the furniture pieces and the build buy items in action, definitely go check out those videos and those might kind of help you be able to decide whether or not you want to put the pack in your game and buy it for yourself or not. So yeah, if you think those videos will be of help to you, definitely go check them out and let me know how you think I did in those videos because let me tell you, it was a challenge and yeah, it, it was definitely fun though. It was definitely fun. You guys know I like a challenge, so thumbs up to me. But yeah, building the starter home kind of really makes you want to like start a let's play and start you know, living in this house and kind of work my way up to the celebrity life. That's something about the path that I really, really love, kind of the starting from the bottom and working your way up because as you guys know, I did do like a homeless challenge let's play on my channel like over a year ago where I did a kind of like rags to riches homeless challenge type of thing where I start with nothing and I work my way up. So I'm definitely really into that kind of thing. So let me know if you guys do kind of want to see a let's play on my channel. It would kind of be like a once per week type of thing, kind of a low commitment commitment let's play so you guys know my channel is pretty chill and stuff like that and I really like to have you know quality videos over quantity so I'm not ever really going to do daily uploads that kind of thing so I also work full time so that's kind of impossible but yeah let me know what you guys think of the idea of maybe starting a let's play with this new get famous expansion pack or if you guys would prefer to see like more renovation videos and more build videos and more challenge videos and stuff like that so yeah definitely let me know it down below but i don't know making the starter home and kind of seeing what the pack has to offer really makes me want to like get in there and start playing with it but yeah i hope that this build kind of gets you guys excited to do that as well but yeah that's all i kind of want to say for today's intro i'll talk a little bit more in the voiceover if there's even any time left Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of today's build. Hey guys, so there isn't very much time for me to do this voiceover because this video is super short because it's a starter home. So it's really small and I ran out of budget like pretty early on. As you can see, I kept checking how much the lot was valued at and I needed it to be under 20,000 simoleons so that's 20,000 simoleons including the cost of the lot so that you can actually afford it when you start playing so I had to delete some stuff and I had to keep making the house a little bit smaller and a little bit smaller each time so that was kind of a struggle kind of a struggle because I didn't want to make the starter home too small because I don't really like it when starter homes are really cramped and tiny but they're really well furnished I would prefer if the home was a little bit bigger but maybe a little bit more sparse that way as you gain more money and gain more furniture you can kind of put in the other extra decorations that you want and you have a really good foundation of a house to work with as you kind of move up and get richer so I kind of did this for my Brindleton starter home. You guys can go check that video out. I made that video a couple months ago, but people really liked that idea where I built them a really nice exterior that was really sparsely furnished, but that way they could kind of grow into the house and not have to like move out of the house immediately because it was so cramped. So that's kind of the starter home I like to build. I feel like it's a little bit more realistic. So I feel like I made you guys like a really nice, playable, mid century, modern, sleek. Um, starter home that you guys can furnish as you make more money so I really like it I like how it turned out I wish I could put more landscaping though so I'm not sure if I will do some editing off camera and make some more sacrifices so I can afford some landscaping but that's always something you guys can add in on your own but you guys did see I have to turn on like the debug cheats thing so I can find a bunch of like free items to kind of decorate the place with because I wanted to add some decorations but I wanted the free ones so that's kind of a good way to get like free decoration items so I did some of that and yeah I wanted to make sure to include like some sort of get famous item here so I have that little youtubers recording station I guess the person who lives here could be like a potential YouTube star on the rise so that's kind of the vibe I was going for there I kind of made it like a youtubers starter home and I hope you guys enjoyed it 
Well, that concludes today's starter home build using the new Get Famous expansion pack. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you liked what you saw today, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below what you thought about it. And if this is their first time meeting, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you want to be friends or if you want to see more Sims 4 videos. I upload these videos once a week at the same time every week, so I will see you guys all next week. Bye, everybody!